Hi fam, random chick here, and today I'm going to be sharing with you how to catch a fucking cheater. So let's start, shall we? Sign number one. So in the early stages of his affair with another girl, he's going to be on a guilt trip. So when he starts buying you shit, like flowers, and is paying more attention to your needs than usual, and your wants, and all this other bullshit that he ain't even thought about in years, big red truck girl, he's fucking cheating. Sign number two, you need to follow your instincts don't ignore that shit so when you start having a gut feeling that this motherfuckers out doing wrong 95% of the time they are doing wrong you want to know why because you know your boyfriend or your husband or whoever the hell you've been with for years or months or whatever better than anything because why girls pay attention to shit okay and you know them better than anybody else knows them so yeah, when you start getting a gut feeling about some awkward ass bullshit, uh, big red truck girl, he's fucking cheating. Okay, so another sign that he's fucking cheating. When he wants to fight 24-7 with you, okay, and not only fight with you, but he wants to fight to, like, for an attempt to fucking get the fuck out of your house. He's like, uh, okay, I'm going to pick a fucking massive fight with this bitch so that I can go and I can fuck my side, bitch. So, if you are fighting way more than normal, and it's pretty much his excuse to get the fuck out the house. Yeah. So, big red truck, he's fucking cheating. Let that motherfucker go. Bye. Another sign. When y'all are fighting, okay, and he pretty much, uh... He pretty much thinks, uh, okay, well, I'm going to fight. Yeah, we're going to fight, blah, 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 blah. And then he's going to be like, uh, I don't think this is working. Uh, I think that we should end this relationship. I think that we should do this, we should do that. So if y'all are fighting, and every time y'all are fighting, he's mentioning that he should uh, end the relationship and leave your ass, 100% of the time, he's fucking cheating. And he wants to leave your ass to get with her. So you need to uh, knuck up or some shit. Yeah. Get some motherfucking brass knuckles and show him what's up. Another sign, okay? If he starts acting all moody and shit, and when I say moody, I'm talking about, like, if he acts all depressed when he's around you, but as soon as he, uh, knows that he can make it a legitimate excuse, sorry, my fucking clock, okay, as soon as he knows he can make a legitimate excuse to get the fuck out of the house, his fucking uh, depression and shit, it just seems to vanish, like, in thin air, like, poof, gone, motherfucker. Another sign. If, uh, let's see, if you and him, uh, pretty much live together, and you used to talk 24-7, you used to communicate 24-7, and now you don't communicate whatsoever, and he acts like he ain't interested at all, and he'd rather watch a damn football game all the time then talk to you i mean a football game every now and then is okay but all the fucking time then talk to you a uh, big red motherfucking truck something ain't going i mean something ain't right another sign uh your motherfucking boyfriend or husband starts criticizing things that they used to love about you that you no longer do like for instance every girl knows this when you're with somebody for a long amount of time you don't want to put on your motherfucking makeup 24 7 uh you're like bitch i'm beautiful without it you know what i'm saying uh you got with me uh you've been with me you know what i mean you know what i look like so basically you stop wearing makeup you know just small shit you still take care of your fucking hygiene i hope because yeah if you don't take care of your hygiene then yeah i don't yeah he should he should go and find another girl but anyways yeah if he starts criticizing you about well, I used to love this about you, you don't do it anymore. I used to love that about you, you don't do it anymore, blah, 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 blah. He's cheating. He's done found somebody that is covering your fucking shit that you should be covering right now. So if I was you, pause this motherfucking video, go slap on some motherfucking makeup, put on a motherfucking naughty, get in the bed with your man. Mm-hmm. 
because you need to spice up some shit. Because otherwise, he going to keep fucking that side, bitch, because she doing something that you ain't. Another sign. If he stops complimenting you on your looks, you know how uh, when you first got together, uh, it was baby this, baby that. Oh, you're so sexy. You're so hot. Well, if he stops that, I mean, I know that is going to, like, decease with time, you know, but if he stops it completely and he never compliments you, uh, and he, oh, another thing, and he never says, I love you, girl, you better get the fuck up out of there, because he's fucking cheating, so when you're fucking man, another sign, when your fucking man starts feeling, uh, guilty because you're being nice to him, and you're doing nice things for him, that's a sign. You want to know why? Because when you do nice things for a fucking cheater, you're not supposed to do nice things. You're supposed to be the one to do miserable things. That way it gives him an excuse. You're supposed to be a bitch 24-7. Mm -hmm. So it gives him a fucking excuse to say, okay, uh, the reason why I cheat on this bitch is because she's a fucking bitch 24-7. And yeah, she's not nice at all. So when you start doing nice things for him and, uh, yeah, he starts his dickhead shit. Yeah, it's because you're supposed to be the one that makes his life miserable. So he's going to feel guilty as fuck when you start doing nice shit for him. When that happens and he feels guilty, he is fucking cheating, chick. Cheating. Another sign. When he starts turning the motherfucking tables on you, saying that you are cheating on him... Yeah, he's got guilt written all over his fucking face. Everybody knows this one, you know, so I just had to throw this one in there. You already know when somebody accuses you, they're doing it. I'm just saying. Another sign, when he shows no interest whatsoever in your future plans. Yeah, when, when you're like trying to speak all serious to him and he's like uh showing no interest whatsoever like he don't want to hear about the future he don't want to know if y'all get a motherfucking dog a white picket fence a brand new motherfucking house he don't want he, he ain't even interested in none of this shit uh yeah he's cheating when he start okay another sign when he starts using all the little catchphrases and all the little jokes that he used when he first got with you that you have not heard in years he's showing you hey bitch uh i tell this joke all the time to my side bitch she laughs at my jokes not to mention i tell these corny ass fucking phrase lines she laughs at these lines see that's what i'm saying shady motherfucker shady motherfucker he's fucking cheating biggest fucking sign ever he starts feeling distracted during sex biggest sign yeah when the sex decreases and he starts feeling like uh this shit ain't right i'm not uh i'm not having sex with the right girl uh no poof be gone cheat 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 cheetah Another sign, when he starts uh, hanging out with, a, with his homeboys more than you. But also, I would be worried about that, because he could be fucking gay, okay? Yeah. He could be using you to keep his ass in the closet. So anyways, guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you like this video, like and comment down below and hit that subscribe. Do not forget to subscribe to me. Okay, yeah, no, I'm not gonna be sad. Anyway, like, comment, subscribe, and uh, tell me if you like this video, I can do another one or a different one on relationship advice. I hope you enjoyed this and have a good night.